Hi there, this is Darren O'Neill from Darren's Tech Tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install Windows Server 2022 on VirtualBox. Okay, so we're just going to get started here. And the first thing I'm going to do is, I'm on Google, I'm going to type in, um, type in Windows Server 2020-22 download. Okay, and where I'm going to click, I'm going to click on the Evaluation Center because I want to evaluate it. And then I want to click to download this ISO. Now this will take a few minutes, that's about 10 gigs. So what I'll do is I'll pause the video and um, we'll come back here momentarily. Okay, mine's finished downloading. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here, I'm going to take uh, Oracle VirtualBox. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click machine, new machine. And I'm going to call it Windows Server 2022, and let's call it demo. And for ISO, um, I've used this recently, so I'm going to click here. Uh, but just navigate to where you download and install. It most likely be called Server Eval. I want to skip the unattended installation because I want to keep an eye on, on what I'm doing here. So if you want to click that, and then I want to click Next. So I want to leave it at around 2 gigs of RAM. I want to give it an extra CPU just so there's a little bit extra um, resources for the VM. I want to click Next. I'm going to click to create a virtual hard disk. That's fine. I want to click next. I want to click finish. Okay, so we can see we have the VM here. So I want to click on it. I want to click to start. And this might just take a second here. So what I'll do is I'll pause it while it's powering up. Okay, so we can see something's happening here. It's beginning to load up the file. So let me just click X on this auto capture and let me just make this a little bit bigger. Okay, so I'm just going to leave it all as the default English United States English. That's absolutely fine. I'm going to click next, and I want to click install now. So we can see setup is starting. So let me just pause the video again um, for a moment while this is doing its thing. And important to say, if you get caught in your window, it's the right control key on your keyboard is the default. Okay, we're actually okay to keep going here. So I want the desktop experience. This is important. If you don't click desktop experience, you won't get the Windows desktop that you're accustomed to. If you want this PowerShell only, um, you can just use the standard evaluation. But I don't want the desktop experience. And I'm going to click next. Okay, I'm going to say yes, I accept the um, I accept the license from Microsoft. I'm going to click on custom here. I'm going to click on drive allocate. So that's the 50 gigs we've created. I'm going to click next on that. And we can see it's started now. So um, what I'll do is we'll pause the video here and we'll come back when the installation is complete. Okay, great. We can see we're back here now. We're being prompted to add a password. So I'm going to do that now. And I'll click finish. Okay, so it looks good. Okay, so let's input and control alt and delete here. Um so we'll do that now. So let me just find that momentarily. Keyboard insert control alt to delete. Okay, let's add that password. Okay, let's give it a second here and hopefully we, we will be in. Okay, this looks good. We're in. Um, so yeah, that was how to install Windows Server 2022 in VirtualBox. I do hope it was helpful. If it was, please do like and subscribe. And please do consider checking out my Patreon, which I will link below. As always, thank you for watching.